Hi right, guys, we got something new for you today, and it is the brand new iMars D300 battery charger from Genzace. This is an addition to their latest dual iMars charger that came out with some awesome new features in it. One of the biggest new features is it allows you to run their new G-Tech batteries and all of the awesome options those come with. Let's get into this charger right now. All right, let's see what you get in the box. We got that there. Let's get this open. On top, you have your instruction manual. I've been running the dual IMRs for quite some time, so I don't need to check that out. You get your D300 charger right there. And we have a little G-Tech accessory pack. Put that down out of the way. Let's figure out how to open this, maybe. Oh, looks like it opens this way. And you get a plethora of cables. So obviously you get your AC power cable. You have your XT60 to EC5 connection. You have a USB connection. Then you get XT60 to EC3 and XT60 to Deans for all you weirdos out there still running Deans. Let's talk about some features of this awesome charger here. All right, let's take a look at what this charger offers. So obviously you have a front facing LED display. You have your output for XD60 here along with the balance ports and the new G-Tech system. You have your DC input in the rear. You have your AC input and your USB output. The nice part about this charger is while you're charging both your batteries at the same time, you can plug in your phone, you can plug in your tire warmers. If you have one of those mob um, audio systems, you can plug that in. You can run anything up to five volts, two amps off this charger. So while I'm out charging, I like to plug my phone in, have it here, get a little charge on my phone as well. The nicest part about this is, is it allows you to monitor both batteries being charged at once. And we're gonna go over that right now. All right, so for simplicity of the video, I went ahead and just hooked up my 4S Gen Zace pack to the back of the DC output. And we're gonna go ahead and demonstrate the awesome features of the new G-Tech packs. So what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're gonna plug in this to port A, and then we will plug in the Dean, the balance port right here. Sorry, doing this upside down. So now you can see it says charging in four, three, two, one, boom. So it automatically sensed what pack this was. It knows it's a high voltage pack. It knows it's 2S and it knows what voltage to charge the pack at. All from just plugging it in. That's all I did was plug it in and you can monitor everything right here. So you can see what amps we're charging at, how many MAH we've put in, and what our current cell value is at. After it goes through, then you'll be able to check the internal resistance once it's done charging, and you have exactly what's going on. You have a G-Tech pack, it's LIHV, it's 2S, the total capacity is, oh, I hit the wrong button. So the total capacity right here is 5,500, and we're charging at 5.5 amps is the safe rate to charge that at. All great features from this charger. Now, what I love about this is since it's all done with the balance connector, we're gonna charge their new 4000 Gen Zace G Tech battery and it has a Dean's connector. So you're not limited to the connector that you can run on your pack like you've been for quite some times now. So, what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're just gonna hook this Dean's connector up. We're gonna go ahead and lay this battery in here and plug in the new Smart Tech into channel two, it's in here. We're gonna go over to channel B right there, and it is already charging the pack. It knows it's a 2S, we're at 3.8 per cell, and like I did in the other one, if you go all the way down, it knows it's a regular LiPo, it knows it's G-Tech equipped. It is a 2S, it's 4,000 mAh, and we're gonna charge safely at four amps. So all of this is done, and both of these batteries are charging without me having to know or do anything. So for those of you that are very new in the hobby and you're not sure what to charge at or how to charge, this is a great option for you. Those of you that have children in the hobby and you want them to be able to charge their own pack, this is awesome. You can let your kid plug in their pack. It'll automatically sense what it needs to be at. You don't have to worry about them charging it 9,000 volts or amps through the system. And it makes it super simple for everybody to use. And can we all mention that we're just charging this off of my spare 4S pack I had laying around for the video, and we're charging at five amps and four amps. 
The great part about this charger compared to the previous iMars charger is from AC input, you can charge at 50% more power and DC input will allow you to charge 16% more power. All right guys, as you saw right there, the new iMars D300 charger is an amazing charger with a ton of features. If you're new into this hobby and haven't made the transition over to LiPo because you're worried about it and you don't know all of the information, this charger takes a lot of that worry out. With the G-Tech batteries, you just plug them in, it senses your cell count, it senses the MAH, it senses the smart level to charge your pack at and immediately starts charging it. You don't even have to worry about it. Also, the nice part is you're not limited to running their battery plug. I mean, in this example, we showed you running a Dean's plug and you're also running an XT60 here. XT60 is my preferred plug, but you could run XT90, Traxxas, whatever you want because everything is done in the balance port. And the greatest part about the balance port, if anybody is running external lights or you're running a direct power servo or if you're running anything off of that balance port in your current truck, it still works. It is a standard balance connector. Like this is just the balance board I had laying around from another company, but it immediately plugs right in. There's no additional parts needed. There's no additional connectors. There's nothing needed to run this and get the benefits of the G-Tech batteries. Also, the greatest part about this is, is you can get the information from this charger that you can only get from a lot of high-end chargers. You can get internal resistance and a lot of other great information out of this. And you're also able to charge 50% more power from your AC charger in this tiny little package. I mean, this thing is super small to drop in your pit bag, take with you. For us crawling guys, when you're out on the trail for seven hours and you don't have enough packs, like... Boom, one 4S pack, I was just charging two batteries off it if you don't have AC. You don't have to worry about plugging it into your battery of your car and killing your car and then not being able to get home from the trail. It has all of the connections, all of the information and the power you need in this tiny box right here. If you guys have any questions about the iMars charger, please comment them below. I will put a link to the iMars charger because it is live now. And thanks for watching. If you haven't, please like and subscribe. Other than that, have a great day.